Hello and welcome to another update video about XRP. Yeah, just a quick update. Not too much has happened. Um, XRP is still in the same situation. We're currently watching primarily here for the white wave count. Um, that will change below 56 cents. Below the 56 cent level, this wave 4 has pulled back too much. It's too deep. Yeah, you cannot really trust a wave 4. Also not in a diagonal structure if it breaks below the 61.8 retracement level and that is here at 56 cents. So at the moment there is a bit of a reaction, right? XRP reacted to this support area. It reacted to our 58.9 cent, 50% retracement level, um, but so far has avoided to break out of this corrective price channel that we talked about in yesterday's video also. The rally so far was only in three waves, which makes it difficult and um, well makes it difficult for it to break out and also it is a low probability wave count because you cannot really i mean if you don't have a five wave move to the upside and just three it could go either way that's the problem so that tells us to be a bit careful here we haven't broken out of the price channel yet and also have not really left the <clears throat> support area to the upside um yeah so xrp did find here some support around 59 cents. We also had previous support here and another um, entry point back here in early November. But overall, yeah, it's all about that 56 cent level. As long as that level is holding, the fifth wave to the upside should give us an ABC structure um, targeting possibly $1 uh, and beyond. Depends a little bit on um, how low the wave 4 goes, okay? Because what we can do is we take the length of waves one through three we go to the low of the fourth wave and okay we might only see maybe 82 cents 90 cents in this fifth wave um, it really depends how low the wave four goes as well so and then we should get a wave two pullback afterwards but we need the five waves first remember my warning i mentioned to you that xrp oftentimes doesn't fill in five waves it often stops at three <clears throat> and then breaks down so we would know that with a break below 56 cents and then it's likely going to test here the lows around 45, 46 cents. The lows that were made in October, September and August. Bit of a triple bottom there. Um, these also rarely hold these triple bottoms, yeah, in contrast to what many people believe or even at least a double bottom. But no, they are not really reversal patterns. Temporarily, maybe, but often they are breaking but yeah we'll, we'll see i mean essentially it, it sort of hinges on the 56 cent level below that level the yellow count plays out and we're dealing here with a w x y structure and this b wave that presumably finished in august will then simply be reset and the c wave to the upside will start a little bit later with a little bit of a delay so it's ultimately important that xrp now shows some strength it still has a bit of space in the support area and we need to pay attention to the upper boundary line of that descending price channel. So yeah, not much happened. So just a quick update. I hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Also make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter for additional content. You can find the links in the video description. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.